about the bullets? Keep the gun clear. Keep the gun clear. Damn gun is cleaner than my room. Nothing came for The police should not be allowed to act on this. A shield! So you reading an email from your wife the other day? Yes. Every Sunday she sent me one, and I answer back. My sons are doing well at the new school. Did I see you reading an email from your wife the other day? Yes. Every Sunday she sent me. One. And I answered back. My sons are doing well at the new school. Nobody knows their father is an oak. When she asks about your life, do you tell her what's going on around here? I used to tell her that things were difficult. But we were making progress. Lately, though, she doesn't ask me. Something's there. Come on, just do it quick. She can, you with me? Thankfully, no. What's your progress? I'm through the living quarters. Looks like I'm into some kind of operations area now. My gut tells me Rucker's gonna be above all this, someplace high. Indefensible. Better find an elevator then. I'll update you with extraction coordinates when I have them. Chicane out. I don't know if I 
We came to be wasting time, but we could be producing content. We are being threatened. should be live on air. We need him to calm the situation. Moving in on Rucker's position. You got those coordinates yet? I'll transmit them as soon as I've finished my coffee. Don't leave me hanging, Chicane. You just worry about getting our man. Be careful. He's dangerous. We'll see. I'm sure you'll understand if I don't take your word for it. You're clearly very skilled. I want to thank you for holding yourself in check on the way in. My friends only want to protect me, but there's been too much bloodshed already. 
You don't seem surprised to see me. I'm not. After the train station attacks, I knew it was only a matter of time before they sent someone. Please, sit. This isn't a social call, Rucker. I'm here to take you in. Our mandate is to fight for the rights of the augmented. Communicate our message, offer assistance. The Ark is a non-violent organization. All right, then this should be easy. Come with me, answer our questions, and we'll have you back here in plenty of time to film your next sermon. I'm not a fool. If I surrender now, I'm never coming back. Once you have me, you intend to make me disappear. But I will not make Solzhenitsyn's mistake. My people and I will resist you. I thought you were a pacifist. I am. But I'm more than a leader. I am a symbol. That is why you wish to erase me. If martyrdom is the only way to remain a symbol, then even my death is preferable to my evaporation. If I have to bring you in by force, I will. And your people will try to stop me. And neither of us wants anyone to get hurt, so come along peacefully. You have my word. I will do everything I can to see that you are treated fairly. You cannot speak to me of peace or fairness. Not when your masters hide in the shadows, manipulating, controlling, murdering without the courage to proclaim their convictions in front of the rest of the world. That's the way power has always worked, Rucker. If you haven't figured that out yet, you need to listen to the people who thought things through a few steps ahead. My life may not have prepared me to be the leader of an activist group, but it is still hypocritical of you to criticize me for using your own methods. I have been patient and understanding. I have taught my people non-violence and waited for the rest of the world to follow that example. I have had faith in humanity, and humanity betrayed me. Follow your example. History has shown that anti-other movements always spring up in times of chaos and fear. Before deciding to become the symbol of the cause, you should have made sure you were prepared for it. I thought I was. I thought I could... God help me, someone had to do it. This is a very precarious time for the movement. These attacks are making everything worse for us. My leadership position within ARC is being threatened, and I suspect the two might even be connected. Please, go back to your people. Tell them to give me 48 hours so I can attempt to resolve the internal conflict. Whether you realize it or not, I'm helping both you and the cause. As long as you stay entrenched in here, the anti are going to point to you as the face of the enemy. This is your excuse? That I should turn myself in because of libelous accusations? As soon as I've been gotten rid of, the anti will spread lies about my successes. Can't you see? If I go with you, I will not only be killed, the Augmented Rights Coalition will be corrupted, my message will be twisted, and history will paint me as the villain.
You can't decide what people will think. Nobody can. All you can do is stay true to your principles. Prove them by your actions. And let history decide based on that. So choose, Rucker. Are you coming in peacefully? Or inciting violence? If I knowingly create a violent situation, I will be as guilty as if I'd fired the first shot. Faced with two terrible choices. I choose the lesser evil. I will come with you. Willingly. Before we leave together, there is something I must show you. I suspect there is a power struggle brewing within our organization. Some people inside Ark are less committed to our ideals. Are you trying to tell me you know who's responsible for the bombings? I have only suspicions, and until recently not even that. The evidence I have begun collecting is meager, but I give it to you. This is the key card for the security door. The evidence is inside. Why give it to me? Why not keep it, present it at your interrogation? Because if my suspicions are correct, and I am seen leaving here with you willingly, I may not survive to present my evidence. Somewhere down there, hiding in plain sight, is your real terrorist. I was trying, secretly, to find out who is responsible. Rucker. Rucker is dead. Come again. I'll fill you in when I see you, which is where exactly? There's some greenhouses near your position. Below them is a clearing. That's where I'll be. Chicane out. Imagine it. I wonder how it is going to 
no matter how much good we do, how much food we grow, how much medicine we give, many still see us as terrorists. I know, brother, I know. But our sacrifices today will make a better world for our children. Yes. Hopefully they will never have to know what we went through. Any shifts I can pick up. I need the hour. Stay sharp, brother. Camo, something right there. Worried about another cat. <laughs> now what? Nothing. Never thought you this got kind anything? of You got anything? Got any shifts I can pick up? I need the hour. We'll talk more later. Pacifism is not the answer, then tell me, what is the answer? I don't know. Every day. Today we discuss it. Carlos isn't able to think about anything else. Then why isn't he doing... about it. You'll have to ask him, or better yet, come up! Tell me you heard that. Can't hurt to check it out. Did you see that?
discuss it. Carlos isn't able to think about anything else. Then why isn't he doing anything about it? Nothing here. Jensen, the meter's running. Where the hell are you? I'm on my way, Shikane. Well, step it up. good Rucker being dead is going to do for us. Your orders were to bring him in. I fully intended to. Then how did this happen? Rucker was convinced someone wanted him to disappear. Instead of pointing fingers, we need to focus on finding out who it was. Before dying, he told me that outside forces were perverting the cause from within. He said he had proof. What kind of proof? You didn't get the time to tell me. So we still have nothing. What about Viktor Marchenko? The name he wanted me to run through iLink? We got back a blank page. What? We got something more on him? Not yet. Just call it a gut feeling for now. Right. So like I said, we still have nothing. Christ. What a mess. You know word of Rucker's death is going to spread, don't you? And when that happens, the head of state police assures me Golem City will become a war zone. We can't let that happen. I hope we're good on juice, Chicane, because I need a ride. 
As for you, Agent... I still have a case to solve, and I know exactly where to start, Director. Smiley's had more than enough time to analyze that DSD I gave him. The one you took from Rizika? I'll check in with him, see what's on it. After that, I'll go where the evidence takes me. I intend to make sure the right people are brought to justice for this, whether they're augmented or not. Get a move on, before this case gets any colder, and keep me in the loop. Let's go, Chicane. dead. What? Poisoned, I think. Holy shit, man. Rucker was the voice of the Augmented. People loved him for it. When word of this hits, Prague is gonna explode. And the whole world's watching. Listen, Miller's gone to meet with state police. Could be our chance to determine his loyalties. He lives near TF-29. You want us to search his apartment? Not us. Me. You keep digging into that Versalife break-in. And see what the Collective can dig up on a Victor Marchenko. If I'm right, and Rucker was poisoned, all three might be connected. Jensen out. Adam, you there? You're not gonna believe this, but Vadim Orloff is in Prague. You're kidding. I wish I were. Six months ago, he got an augmented expert's visa and has been... ever since. Border control logged him in this morning. I arrived in Prague six months ago. Where's he staying? In the Lilioma Courtyard Apartments on Lavani Street, second floor. I'll check it out. you need what do you want hypo stims pick up a prescription if you want Mikel or the doctor they're not here this place has a doctor oh yes dr. Sipra mr. big shot from Tai Young what thinks he's too good for a place like this Tai Young what did he do for them? <laughs> he calls it experimental neurotherapy. If he's so good, how come his patient ran away and he can't find her? What does an experimental neural therapist do, exactly? He is vague about it, and I don't care enough to ask. You want something else? Who is Mikhail? My nephew. He works here as an assistant, but he didn't show up for work today. His apartment is just across the street. Would it have killed him to let me know he can't come in? Probably not. Especially since you seem like such an approachable boss. Did you come here for something? I'll be going. Do what you want. Have problems already. <laughs>
Seraph, I found Orloff. He's dead. What? Are you sure it's him? Well, technically, I never met him before. I did, however, meet a doctor who looks just like him in Alaska. In that clinic I told you about? His name then was McFadden. Christ, Adam. What exactly happened to you in that clinic? I don't know. I was in the coma ward. It was run by the World Health Organization. Facility 451. Can you dig into it? I'm gonna search this body and the apartment, and see what I can find. Thank you. 